Hello everyone. International Scientific Research and Publications is providing innovation awards. Let us know who can nominate for the awards. Universities, colleges, higher educational institutions, schools, coaching institutes, academics and research scholars, corporate and industry, international organizations and associations, consultants, startups, etc. If you have any other doubts or queries, you can contact us through this WhatsApp number or mail us through this mail ID. Thanks for watching. Academy. In today's video, we will be going to see the difference between scoopers and web of science. Do you know what are scoopers and web of science? Scoopers and web of science is the largest worldwide used citation databases. Today, these are the most respected platforms for analyzing peer reviewed literature, scientific publications, conference proceedings, and books. Do you know what is Web of Science? The Sci Scientometric Web of Science WOS database consists of over 33,000 publications. WOS contains search data filters as title, publication name, year published, author, document type, and more. A variety of sorting options allows browsing through large volumes of data first. The basis of Index Web of Science resources is comprised of scientific publications in natural, exact and social subject areas. And do you know what is Scopus? Yes, we had already discussed about Scopus in the previous videos. So let us know about it. Scopus is one of the largest database that hosts 23,700 titles from 5,000 publishers. Scopus contains scientific literature on various disciplines, articles, abstracts, books, collection of conference, and monographs. The publications are updated daily, thus users are provided with access to large volume of the latest information. So users can able to gain the latest updates of the journal or the publications every day. And it enables them to track current trends as well as find colleagues from joint research. Scopus has special tools that allow the researcher to go further into the field of research, data analysis, and monitoring link usage frequency. And do you know what is the difference between Scopus and Web of Science? WOS and Scopus share a lot of common features. Nevertheless, these databases have a couple of significant differences. For instance, the Web of Science database allows deeper search of published papers dating back to 1900, whereas Scopus covers more modern materials. Besides, the topic of research is also important, while Web of Science collects information on the natural, technical and social sciences. Scopus also has a widely variety of publications in the humanity field, although neither of them is considered to be specialized. So, which is better, Scopus or Web of Science? Let me discuss about it. When comparing the use of Web of Science and Scopus in academic papers, there is no definite answer regarding which database is better. Most users agree that these platforms complement each other. Scopus offers a more extensive list of modern resources. An additional advantage of Scopus in the implementation of an independent sourcing system. Moreover, its interface is often considered more user friendly. Web of Science on the other hand provides the most in-depth citation by source. Another advantage of using WOS is the availability of large volume of scientific literature published in the past. Both systems subdivide sources into quartiles according to the citation level. Based on the indicator, you can access their quality. All in all, both platforms are equally efficient. So they offer the functionality that allows the user to achieve the assigned tasks without difficulties. The specific choice directly depends on the goals 
pursued by the researcher. So, from this we can able to understand that web of science has a greater depth of scientific citations while scoop has focuses on more modern sources because its database was found later and the scopus is younger. And let us know how web of science is differed from scopus database. Both databases are used by subscription and both have research functions. The difference between these two is that clarative, clarivative analytics is more selective and more demanding from the material its index. The scopus is more inclusive and contain more types of material and therefore it is less selective. Here is a small comparison about Scopus and Web of Science till the year 2020. So, Scopus has 25,100 active indexed journals and 14,558 inactive journals. Web of Science has 21,100 indexed active journals and it has no inactive journals. And Scopus has 1,20,000 events and 9.8 million papers indexed proceedings and Web of Science has 2,10,000 events and 70 million citations and this date range from 1970 to the present and this range from 1900 to the present and Scopus is updated daily, Web of Science is also updated daily and it has a citation analysis, export records, export reports and alert service also available in both of the services. So in this video we had discussed about the difference between web of science and scoopers. I think this video will be helpful for you. If you have any doubts and queries regarding to this you can comment us below or contact through this whatsapp number displayed in the video or you can also visit our, our website for more queries. Thanks for watching.